Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today, I'm going to be sharing with you my July favorites. I know I'm pretty dressed up for a monthly favorites because I like to keep these videos more casual, but I am doing a look for Instagram. So can you guess which cartoon character I was inspired by? Can I give you some clues? Powerpuff Girls. Last month, I mentioned to you guys that I'm going to share with you so much more makeup products and maybe I might have lied because this month I do have makeup favorites but it's not as much as I was expecting. I guess some things that I tried out, I just want to try out for a little bit longer before I mention it into my favorites because my favorites are like holy grail stuff, okay? But either way, I still have a bunch of things that I want to share with you guys and this video is probably going to be super long anyway regardless so let's just jump straight into the favorites all right so we're gonna start off with the lifestyle category because i want this to be the first mention of today's video which is the silver plug i think it came in the beginning of july and oh it's just so pretty isn't it and i just wanted to show this with you guys on camera because this is our achievement i wouldn't have been able to get this if you guys did not subscribe to me and watch my videos so this is for us i want to get it framed because it's getting a little bit dusty and I don't want to like even touch it or get my fingerprints on it because it's so precious to me I just want to thank you guys and show this to you guys because this one is for us thank you so much I still cannot believe that we have passed this milestone but this definitely was the first thing that I want to share with you guys because definitely the highlight of my month was receiving this in the mail it came so quick as well and for my next lifestyle favorite is actually this watch here from Nordgreen I did a sponsored video with them in the month of July this video isn't sponsored but I did forget to mention a couple of things about the brand and the watch in that video so I'm just going to mention it here. Nonetheless, this is still a favorite because I literally have been wearing this all month. It's just my go-to watch now. I think it's because of the brown strap. I really like that and the gold hardware. It gives more like a vintage sort of everyday casual vibe. I also love how it's a vegan leather and I didn't mention in my sponsored video but the leather on this is like super super soft. Like it's so soft and it feels so nice against the skin. But a little bit about Nord green this is designed by jacob wagner he's a really well respected designer in scandinavia with over like 20 years of experience and nord green also works with three non-governmental organizations so when you purchase a watch or anything off this site you have the ability to donate to one of these three causes which is great so if you guys are interested in nord green or you're looking to buy a new watch for yourself or for a gift you can use my discount code judy it will save you 15 percent off your purchase on nordgreen.com all right, so let's move in to the next category. Let's talk about some makeup. I have some products from Kaleidodose Makeup. They sent over these products in a PR for me to try out and I have been loving them. The first one is the Tone Activator Eye Primer. If you guys watched my previous video, I talked a little bit more about it and showed you how I use it. So pretty much this has been my go-to eye primer. Before this, I was using a concealer as my eye primer, but I feel like using this eye primer, it's thinner and it doesn't feel as heavy on the eyes. I feel like a concealer can be a little bit thicker. So I've been liking this as my eye primer. It sort of does the same thing as a concealer, but it's just much thinner and like less cakey on the eyes, I guess. So I've been really liking this. It's a really affordable eye primer as well. It's only 10 US dollars. And then my other favorite product from Kaleidodose this month is their Lo-Fi Duo Blusher. I like the one in Lo-Fi Peach. They have another one, but I definitely like the peach one a lot. I don't really use the highlighter in here. I'm mainly using the blush because the blush is just so pretty. It's the perfect muted peach blush. It's perfect for everyday wear. I adore this blush. I'm not wearing it right now because I am doing an inspired look, but on my everyday when I'm just going out, this is the blush that I am wearing and I love it. It's like such a pretty blush. The formula is beautiful as well. I do like the highlighter, like the formulation of the highlighter. It's just not a highlighter that I would wear every day, but nonetheless, I think getting this duo is already worth it. You are paying for high quality packaging and high quality formulation, so I just love this blush duo. I then have have some products from elf cosmetics i did a review on some of the products that i picked up these two out of that review are probably the products that i use the most often especially this lipstick this is their seriously satin lipstick in the shade nectar and i love this so much i specifically like the color i mean the formulation is good as well but it is a little bit matte but it's still very comfortable but the color is just perfect this lipstick with this blush is just the best combo ah 
I love it. This definitely has been one of my holy grail everyday lip colors. It's living in my top drawer, so it's easy for me to grab. I wore this so much, and it's so affordable as well. And honestly, I love this clear packaging. I love this aesthetic, so... Definitely, definitely would recommend the Seriously Satin Lipsticks. I low-key want to get all of the shades and do a lip swatch review for you guys. But yeah, hopefully soon I'll be able to build up a little collection of them and do a review on. But so far, Nectar is just chef's kiss. And the other lip product from e.l.f. that I've been liking is their Lip Lacquer. I haven't been wearing this one as much as the lipstick because it's been pretty windy here. And when it's windy, I don't really like to wear glosses too often because it's going to stick like even more. But this gloss is so pretty. Did I even say the name for you guys? It's called a Moody. And the fact that it's called a Moody, I love it even more because my like game name is Judy Moody. So I just love that. It's an opaque gloss. So you can just use it on its own or you can apply it on top. But it's super juicy, super glossy. And now on to the last product in this category. It's actually a skincare product and it's from Paula's Choice. It's their 2% BHA liquid exfoliant. And you guys, I've never used a skincare product that I've seen such a huge difference instantly. This product is magic in a bottle. I've been watching a lot more skincare YouTubers recently. It's been by Hiram and Sarah Sachu and also Leah Yu. And I've just been learning a lot more about ingredients. I'm a little bit more aware wear about it and Sarah uses this product a lot and I thought I would give it a go. I'm so glad I did and I definitely want to try more products from Polish Choice. It is a little bit pricey. This bottle I think was about 60 Australian dollars. So it was the only product that I got but literally I would buy backups of this any day because the way this makes my skin look is just so good. I mean, I've been doing a couple of new things in my routine that could be the reason for my skin looking so much clearer and smoother, but when I used this guy for the first time, literally the next day I was like, my pores look smaller, they are less visible, my skin, it just feels like it's been polished down or something. I mean, obviously my skin is not perfect, but I know the longer I use this product, I know my skin is going to look so much clearer and I just want to try more from Polish Choice because this brand is no joke. I don't know if it's going to work on every skin type. I'm not, you know, a skincare expert, but I'm learning and this product is just magic in a bottle, literally. Like, it's so good. I mean, a couple of other things that I've been doing in my routine is that I haven't been wearing foundation pretty much at all. I probably wore it once in July, once in June. So I'm just wearing tinted moisturizer. Even now, I'm just wearing tinted moisturizer and concealer. So it might be that I'm letting my skin breathe a little bit more because I'm not wearing foundation. I've been actually drinking more green tea in the mornings and that's like the first thing I drink. So it's like, I guess detoxing a little bit. I don't know. I feel like those three are the major things that's been changing in my routine that could be the result for clearer skin. And I'm also drinking a lot more water. So green tea, water, no foundation, and this product, it's all making my skin feel a little bit clearer. Obviously, I have this pimple here today, but... From far away, you can't you can't even see. So before we move into the next category, I'm actually going to be doing a giveaway in this video, and it's going to be with Olands again. In my last month's favorite, I did a giveaway with Olands, and that went so well. A lot of you guys joined, and there was three winners, which was so amazing. Because usually giveaways, I only have one winner, so it was nice that there was three winners, and all the girls are contacted, and they are getting their prizes shipped out. But Olands is actually having a promotion week. It's called Color O Week, and and it's from today, I think the day you're watching. So the 3rd of August to the 7th of August. It's a week-long promotion. I wrote it down so I wouldn't get it wrong. But their promo is that they're going to sell three packs of lenses for $9.90. There's only going to be 100 boxes, so it's pretty limited. But the price on that is just crazy. I mean, pretty much $10 for three packs of lenses. I think a pack of lens from Olin's is about like... $25, $20, so you're saving a lot of money, but it is very limited. And also there's going to be a clearance sale from 50% off, so half price. It's a really amazing deal, so I just wanted to share that with you guys, and they are going to be doing another giveaway with me, so I'm going to leave all the rules down below with the prizes and everything. And also they gave me a code. This is not an affiliate code. I don't earn commission from this if you guys use the code. It's just for you to use, I guess, as part of their promotion. But you can use my code JUDY to save 10% off, and this code will 
will expire at the end of the month so on august 31st so you have the whole month to purchase if you miss out on these promotions during this week you still have the rest of the month to use my code and save a bit of money and now on to the last category is entertainment so i have one tv show that i want to recommend to you guys that i have been loving so much it's another korean variety show it's called the genius i believe there are three seasons i'm currently on season two so i finished season one and it's such a good show it's such a genius show it's really hard to explain so the season starts off with 10 or 12 contestants and they are all pretty like smart they are all known to be like have high iqs and stuff like that and they have these like little gems and they're called garnets and that's like the game's currency so one garnet is one thousand dollars pretty much and then everybody will play a game that everybody's included and there's a winner and a loser so the loser goes into the death match and they choose another opponent to go to the death match with two people in the death match battle it out and then one person gets out so every week one person is eliminated and they're playing different games every single week and it's really really fun the sun is coming out but it's just really interactive and the games just hurt your brain this betrayal and it's just a really really great show it's a pretty old show so some of you guys might already seen it if you're familiar with korean variety shows sorry about the sun by the way don't spoil season 2 winner because I don't know who it is yet. Really great show. Highly, highly recommend. And then we have my music favorites. I'm just going to do the same thing that I did last month and just leave my July playlist to my Spotify so you guys can listen to the music yourself because I can't really play anything because of copyright. But my absolute favorites from this month is definitely Crush Let Me. That song is just 90s vibes, boys to men vibes. Just so, you know just so good he can make no bad songs you guys know that i love him lehigh came out with a new comeback hollow i love that song there's so much emotion in that song as well and she's like literally my new girl crush i've been watching so many more of her live performances like i've always liked her but i don't know her comeback and just her aura her vibe i like she's like my new girl crush and there's one new artist that i discovered his name is ha sung Woon. i watched dk dk's tv top five k-pop albums of 2020 so far and his album plays number one one and then i checked it out and once i checked it out i fell in love i feel like his music is just so good if you're not into k-pop maybe give his album a go because it's definitely different it's very funky very easy on the ears and his voice is so good the tone i love his voice so much and i've seen his some of his live performances his stage presence i believe he was part of 101 before and like oh, cookie cookies here oh my big boy i think he was part of like produce 101 and he was part of the group 101 but yeah i really love him and i've been listening to his music ever since i discovered it so yeah let's be lazy lovers just lazy lovers all right you guys so that is my july favorites i hope you guys found some new discoveries in today's video i would love to hear some of your monthly favorites in the comments down below and hopefully i can check it out for myself it could be anything music tv shows makeup skincare i would love to hear it if you guys did enjoy this video give it a thumbs up for me i would appreciate it so much if you did it also helps me out as well and it just lets me know that you guys love my monthly favorites and i'll continue to film them but yeah i'm going to quickly wrap things up because the sun is coming out again thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe if you haven't already i love you guys and i'll see you in my next video bye